Hey guys, Ali Fox here. Welcome back to some modded RimWorld. We are picking up in Stoneville. Last episode, we had a, I believe it was a, uh, a centipede attack with one of those annoying inferno launcher things. So we've got some rebuilding to do here. We got no weapons, uh, no weapon turrets rather. We've got burned down walls. I did manage to save our farms. Uh, I did actually figure out the problem with the um, the weird texture issue with uh, the vent. Um, just unloading and reloading the mod helped. I still haven't figured out how to fix the uh, weird issue with the vegetables, though. It's, that one's a little bit baffling. Anyways, um, a lot of work to do here. There's no enemies on the, on the map as far as I can tell, which is good. Oh, no, we do have one gun left. That one there, which we could probably decommission, actually. Well, I think I'm going to deconstruct that and save the steel. Yeah, we've got a ways to go here. Uh, I never did get stone cutting up and running, did I? What are they doing? Electric smelting? No, I do have stone cutting. I just don't have a stone cutting table. Or do I? I better double check that. No, I'm not seeing the stone cutting table. Uh, I do think getting a stone cutting table up and running would be a good idea. We can start replacing some of this wood with stone, which is a lot more durable. No, it's not that one. There it is. Um, we can have enough wood for that. Oh yeah, we got lots, lots of wood. I'll just stick it right there. Sounds good to me. Additionally, we are in the process of digging out. Uh, future bedroom areas, and I'm going to expand uh, a kitchen or a dining room area over here at some point. I also uh, these getting these bedrooms done ASAP is important because right now we've got a lot of people sharing rooms, which I don't like. Uh, what is everybody doing out of curiosity? Resting, resting, hauling. And India still is missing a leg. All right, let's. Uh, since people are going to be resting, I'm going to go ahead and stick it on speed three for a little bit. Got a lot of repairs to do too. I'm actually thinking I'm just going to tear those areas down rather than spending the time repairing them. With the exception being the power cords there and this section of wall. I'm going to tear that down as well. All right. Now, hopefully they won't go and repair it before they tear it down. That would be kind of annoying. Ah, no, they're not. Good, good. Got a little bit of extra steel going on here. Good. How are we doing for steel? Most of it, well, yeah, most of it's stockpile, but we got some pieces laying around here and there. That's fine. Stone crafting table now. Sandstone or granite. I kind of want to say stand sandstone has more health, which seems weird. Yeah, I believe this is based on how many hit points uh, excuse me, a wall of the appropriate type has. So I do know limestone has more than slate, and no limes granite has more than limestone, and I know marble has the lowest. So that makes me believe sandstone has the highest. So I'm going to go ahead and just set this up to build a bunch of sandstone blocks. I'm also going to redesign this gate area here a little bit, make it a little more defensible. It's something I've been meaning to do for a while, but never really talked about. What's the stockpile here for? Uh, wood. It's a wood stockpile. Okay. Wow, the day passed really quickly. I did not take it off speed three. Oh, our prisoner died. Damn it. 
I was hoping to recruit him. Wonder how he died. Let's take a look. Probably blood loss. Yeah. Did we not have anybody doctoring? Yeah, we did. Blair was set to doctoring. Becker was set to wardening. Huh. We got plenty of medicine. No. That's one of the drawbacks of playing on Speed 3, obviously. Oops. Alright. Okay, what's going on? What do we got going on? Pirates. And they want to besiege the colony. Oh, fantastic. That's all we needed. Oh, there's not even a few of them, too. Wow. My difficulty is really getting ramped up here. Well, where are they going to go? What I would love right now is if, like, there's a psychic wave that drew, drove animals mad. Alright, so... Right up through there, huh? Well, it's a long trek unless I mine this out right here. In which case... That actually seems like probably the most logical thing to do. Um... I do think I need to build at least one turret gun, though. Okay. So let's build one there, and let's build one here. Actually, not there. Uh, let's build it here. Hmm. Turn that off for now. Let me think. How do I want to do this? Becker's got the Wa 2000. Blair's got the Wa 2000. And Rigo has just got a bolt action rifle. None of my guys are expendable. There's no way I can get a decent sniping position without counter fire. They actually chose their their building spot really well. This may be down here. Hmm. All right. Well, okay. No, I didn't want a character. I wanted orders. I guess let's go ahead and mine this out. Becker, what are you doing? You're feeding somebody? Yeah, that's fine. Rego is eating. Blair researching. How much research is left? Yeah, I'll let him finish that up. That's not too much longer. Okay. Not going to research anything else. Blair eating. Becker moving. No. Uh, I would help if I selected the right person. There you go. Carrying steel. Oh, but I need that turret done too. Uh, okay, who do I want to get this done? Uh, Becker's got a mining of six. Blair a five. Rego a three. Well, I guess Rego, as soon as you finish eating, you can go and work on that. Okay. Prioritize mining. It'll take a bit. But once I get some turrets, those two turrets done. And as I mentioned in my, uh, in a, a comment over on, in the last episode, it seems like my colony is just stumbling from emergency to emergency to emergency. I can't make any sort of footholds. Go ahead and toggle power on that. Oh, the, uh, the pirates are assaulting the colony. Interesting. And very unexpected. And now they're fleeing? What? The hell? Did... What? 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 Oh! 
Oh, they're being attacked by some, uh, by some travelers. Oh, awesome. Okay. Well, that was pretty amazing, actually. I didn't even see the travelers over there. I thought maybe they were being attacked by the rhino for some reason. Huh. Okay, well. I'm not going to complain at all, and it gives me a bunch of loot. One sec while I scratch my eye. Alright. So now it's even more important to finish this so I can go and get that loot more easily without having to travel all the way around the world. Practically. Oh, Blair, there you are. Okay. Go ahead and turn the power on that off. Okay, so... Wait, how much space do I have to hold... Okay, they're being held in there. Alright, that's good. So, let's see. What am I going to salvage out of this? A sack cross K11? What's that? Powerful disintegrator pistol? Nice. Very powerful, but poor accuracy and range, which makes it favorite as a backup sidearm. 19, or 14 damage. Yeah, the accuracy is pretty awful. But useful fighting in my base area, for example. Let's go ahead and unfurbit those. And those. What's this? Some Mossberg 500s, a shotgun. A sawed off auto 5s, another shotgun. Another shotgun. Not oh, a lot of shotguns here. Some stun grenades. Possibly useful. A ton of iron. A ton of. Survival meals. Nice. Okay. Do they only build the one turret? Or the one mortar? Looks like it. Go ahead, claim and deconstruct that. And claim and deconstruct these sandbags. All worth it. Worth it, worth it, worth it. Okay, what's going on here? Is that the group that just uh, took out the pirates for me? If so, thank you. What's we got down here? I'm just gonna actually just stick on hauling. Oh, there was some dead buffalo down here. Well, that sucks. I would have loved to have added them to my food source, or my food supply, rather. Okay, I'm going to crank up hauling for a little bit. Nope, wrong way. Get some of this hauling done, because there's a lot of it to be done. I got real lucky with that uh, group of pa uh, travelers taking out the pirates for me. Definitely. Oh, wait, we got a pirate who's still alive. Is she worth capturing? Too smart. No, not worth it. Mental break threshold. Mental break threshold of plus 20 is brutal. I definitely am not good for that. So you know what? I think we'll capture her and maybe sell her to slavery. To, to slavery. Rego, you will go and capture me. And it looks like everybody else is dead. Oh, I had, had it on pause. Actually, Rego, before you actually capture her, I'm going to get you to strip these other bodies first. Okay, so strip Z, strip Frenchie, strip Santos. Okay, now go and capture me.
Now it's too bad Emmy has the two smart trait, otherwise she'd be a good capture. Because her skills aren't bad, especially her mining skill. It wouldn't be bad to have another person. Oh, maybe I should harvest a leg and stick it on mm. India. Oh, what's this? Emmy has developed an infection in her neck. Okay. Do you have any regular medicines? No, they got burned apart. Damn it. Unless we have some down in here. We do not. Oh. Where did Rego go? Oh, there he is. I need you to strip mare and then haul away his body. Is it too cold? No, it's too hot. Okay. Turn that back on. 86% recruitment, so I'm just going to friendly chat, doctor care, but no medicine. Ah, yeah, I guess I'll use medicine. Okay, good, good. Uh-oh, what's going on now? Oh, and use birthday. I find it crazy we still haven't been able to get a leg for her. What is it, a thousand gold? Fourteen hundred gold. Wait, four, yeah, fourteen hundred. Math is hard. Now, what's going on over here? Do we have people uh, hauling goods yet? Doesn't look like it. No, everybody's asleep. Rego, what are you doing? Eating from a simple meal? Becker, what are you doing? Chatting with Emmy, alright. Wow, Blair actually managed to treat her with uh, regular medicine. That's pretty good. Okay, Blair. Ah, uh, fine. Feed the prisoner. Okay. Rego, before you harvest, I want you to come over and haul some stuff. Haul all of these survival meals. Ooh, it's raining. Good, good. You are Calling a dead person to a stockpile. Blair, you are feeding a building. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Uh, mental break and it's going on a rampage. Fine. Alright. Blair, what are you doing? Is there a melee weapon right here for Blair to equip? Uh, it doesn't look like it. And uh, he does have armor on, though. So, I'm gonna draft him. Melee attack. This should be pretty one sided. Bemmy and capture. Rego doesn't have body armor, so Rego, once you've done hauling those package meals, I should put that armor on. No, go back to speed two. Rego, where are you? There you are. And then you can go back to your regular scheduled hauling. Another mental break. Um, Blair? No. Okay. We probably just had to eat. Yeah, because I'm lacking in uh, an actual doctor's medicine, like not uh, the herbal medicine. I can't harvest any for organs or parts, otherwise I would totally lop off a leg and give it to India. Uh, gotta love not needing anti-rejection meds, I guess. God, you guys are sleeping already? You should get rid of your beds. Just drive you into the ground. Okay, Blair, what are you doing? Healing Emmy, okay. Rego, harvesting. Uh, 
is set to one on growing. I'm going to set you to two on growing because those can last a while. No, it's being used. Okay, so go ahead, harvest that one or whatever, uh, and then go back to hollow the ship. So yeah, we do need some food made. I guess I could live on survival being uh, another mental break. You know what? What is her mental health? It's just psychotic. Okay. Well. Urgently hungry, prison, sick, ugly environment, in darkness, and wounded. Well, uh... Alright, Becker, how about you clean up some of this blood crap in here? There's me too. At least clean up some of this stuff. And... Somebody's already doctoring, or wording rather. All that buffalo's clips from all this blood. <laughs> okay, let's try and clean up as much of this blood as possible, I guess. It's a bit of a time waster, but on the other hand. While I don't want really to recruit her, I would rather not have to deal with her going Ah, oh, shoot. I'd rather not have her go crazy all the time, either. Okay, so we got all the blood at least cleaned up. The rest, I'm not too worried about. So people can go back to hauling. What's left over here to haul? Quite a lot, as it happens. How are we on food? You know what? Maybe we'll hunt these guys down as well. Might as well. Since we've got a freezer, it's not a problem to hunt, uh, just hunt all the things. There we go. Lots of animals to kill. Lots of hauling to be done. Apparently there's not enough time in the day. Alright, I'm going to bump it back up to speed 3 for a little bit. Just going to kind of watch them scurrying around and doing their jobs. How is Emmy's thoughts now? Wait until the chatting is done. Okay, so... Spacious interior, convinced by Warden. In darkness, sick, imprisoned, and hungry, but hunger will take care of itself. Yeah, okay, so she's doing a little bit better. Uh, what do we got going down over here? Oh, there's a squirrel I can hunt as well. I have this thing about hunting squirrels. Um, I have lost a lot of people in my dozen or, well, several dozen games that I've played that consider squirrels to be the ultimate evil in this world. More evil than the pirates, more evil than the tribals, far more evil than the mechanoids. A single scratch can be enough to kill a person. Probably due to rabies or some other sort of fairly nasty 
disease. It always ends up being death by infection. Alright, don't leave the meat outside. Haul it, like, now. When it's 44 degrees out, you do not leave meat laying around outside. I'm sorry. Okay, still keeping things on speed 3 while I, uh, keep an eye on what's going on. They haven't done a lot of hauling yet. They have shot down some of the animals, though, which I guess is a good start. Might as well put hunting on that squirrel as well. Alright, maybe let's fiddle around with some of their priorities. It's less priority on hunting, more priority on hauling. Should be good. Keep those priorities up, though. Blair, what's your thoughts like? Hot, ugly environment, and unpleasant conversation. Yeah, that uh, uh, trait, abrasive that India has, this is a little on the annoying side. What are her thoughts like? Optimist, spacious, imperial, social chat, but is hungry. Okay. Make sure temperatures are okay, 17 degrees in there. A little on the warm side in here. Uh, 15 in there. 16. I'm actually surprised it's as warm in here as it is. Given that it's in the negatives in here. Usually there's more uh, transfer of heat through doors. But 25 isn't bad, I guess. I have worked in kitchens that were a lot hotter than that. Unfortunately. Okay, no food is being left outside. Good. Scout. Not interested. I like to stay on the good side of the tribals and uh, outlanders. Speaking of which, what is my faction like with them? White Stingray Braga Tribe. You know, we've got good relations with the two outlander towns that I might almost be tempted to deliberately piss off the White Stingray Braga tribe in order to maybe gain a useful person at some point. However, if I remember correctly, scouts are kind of awful. Now you'd think scouts would be really, really good. Oh, there's some silver. You'd think scouts would be really good, but frankly, they're not. Steadiness is river, I think, is somebody that I like, right? Yes. Okay, so, actually, this is river, this is river. Okay, so where did that scout go? I'll kind of show you why. It's, it's not their skill bonuses so much as the stuff that they're forbidden to do, which is like a lot of useful things. Huh, where is he? Is he here? Bear, Becker, Rego here, maybe? That's propellant. Steel. What's that? A dead iguana. Huh, where is he? Ah, you know what? It's not that important. Just trust me when I say that I don't like scouts. Using... Oh, is that him there? La Vigo? Ah, there he is. So, Scout. Huh. He's just incapable of caring. I was pretty sure it was Scouts that were really awful. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe he is worth capturing. Let's see. Social is decent. Shooting is really good. Research. What are his thoughts like? Naked and very hot. No specific injuries. You know what? I think maybe I will try and catch him. I might take back what I said about scouts. I might even think it's scavenger, not scout. Uh, so let's see about getting a bed thrown together quickly for this gentleman. Uh, who can do it? Rigo, what are you doing? You're hauling a dead iguana? No. You are now building a wooden bed. You are still going to be building a wooden bed. Emmy, stop standing on the wooden bed that I'm trying to build. 
Okay, now, is he still around? Can I capture him? Did he already leave? He may have already left. Uh, I don't see him anywhere, unless he came into my base. Blair, Chihuahua, no. Blair. There's no way he could have gotten that far, not as a slowpoke. Chihuahua was from the town, right? Yeah, okay. Is he in here? No. That's a squirrel. There's a lot of squirrels in here, actually. That's kind of disturbing. Nope, alright. Okay, well, I guess I missed my chance. Next time. Next time I will try and capture somebody from the, uh, the tribal town. As long as they're half decent. You know, as long as they can do uh, dumb hauling, which is you know, cleaning and hauling, um, I'm going to be interested in them. Okay, what are my people doing now? Becker, you are hauling wood. Blair, hauling wood. And Rigo, hauling iguana. Okay, well, Rigo, once you're done hauling that iguana, I want you to haul more of these meals. Because I've discovered that lives Oh, he's already hauling meals. Okay. I've noticed that livestock will eat meals. Or not livestock. Uh, wild animals will eat meals. Which is really crazy. Okay, Blair. We're going to put down that 13 wood and carry a bunch of uh, meals instead. Becker, feeding a meal to India, that's fine. <coughs> Are we cooking simple meals? Okay, I'm going to suspend that. I would rather cook fine meals, because fine meals are obviously better. blocks, 75 blocks, 75 blocks. That's actually pretty decent. Uh, I think what I'm going to do then I'm going to build some granite embrasures say right here and Granite wall there, and a granite wall there, maybe? Yeah. Give them a, a bit of a, a loop that they have to go through if they're coming from the south. So they'll stop there. You know what, I don't need as much of that. Actually, I don't want any of... Oh, yeah, okay, it's conduit and bracer. Yeah, I do want that. So now let's put... Some more bracer here, I guess. It's not optimal, but where I have the entrance position, it'll have to do. Especially since I have my, uh, my, uh, storage yard here for my orbital trade beacon. Loader from White Stingray Braga. Let's go take a look at him. Jump to location. Well, he's apparently naked. He's got a short bow. Social. Incapable of social. That's fine. He's warm-skinned, green-thumbed. Uh... Warmed skin is not good at all in a desert area. Good grower, decent shooter, decent me good melee, decent medicine. You know, he's not bad. He's naked and very hot. 
All right, yeah, let's capture him. Um, Becker, you are hauling silver. You can put that silver down and arrest him. There we go. Yes, that's fine. You are arrested. White Springray Braga is now my enemy, but that is okay. I'm probably going to not be able to convert him, but you know what? I'm going to try anyway. It's 76%. That's medicine. I'm draft. Go back and do your hauling. Those have been hauled good because I want to build a granite block door right there. That'll all slow enemies down that need to come through there a little bit. Give me additional time to uh, prepare myself. How are we doing for food? Food's okay, it's just meals that are a little low. Wait, hold on. Are we cooking simple meals because we don't have anybody that can cook better? Yeah, okay. Sorry about that. I'm going back to simple meals. I forgot. Unsuspend that. Emmy. Did we want to capture Emmy again? No, she had the two smart, right? But her skills are good. Well, uh, no, her skills aren't that good. Okay, you know what, Emmy? Now that you appear to be safe from death, I'm going to go ahead and release you. If you come back, though, we're going to make sure we kill you. Release. Uh, yeah. Emmy, go away. Tell your people that we do not wish... Well, we don't care if you're hostile or not. We just don't want to feed you anymore. Good. Bye. Berulo is going to be a tough nut to crack, but I think we can do it. Let's see, how's the hauling coming over here? Pretty decent. It's unfortunate they can only carry one piece of clothing at a time. I don't know about you guys, but I know I can carry three or four jackets and a bunch of jukes all at once. That might be something to uh, consider looking into, Mr. Developer, in the unlikely event that you're actually watching my video, of course. What's this? This is just a regular door, right? You know what? I'm going to just Eh, uh, better not. Okay, hauling. Ah, it's so much stuff to haul after a after a pirate raid. Jeez. How many of these meals are left? Eight, twelve meals, thirteen, thirteen meals. Well, that does give us a nice backup in case we start to run dry, but. Now they're going to go to bed, aren't they? Uh, no. You can go a little bit longer without sleep. Becker, I want you to go and pick up that. Blair, you are eating. Rego, I want you to go and pick up that. And Blair, once you're done eating, are going to go and haul. No, there's no place to put it, really. Uh... Okay, well then, you can haul that. Is there really no place to haul grenades? What's this? Storage, weapons, grenades. Well, grenades are listed as being available to go in here. That's a little odd. Actually, it's a lot odd. Where are you going? Hauling Synthroid Tunic, Hauling Package Survival Meal, and... Okay. 
that actually looks like it'll be it for the hauling jobs. So once they're done that, I'm going to change their priorities back, get some of that hunting done, and get some of the construction done. Actually, the construction's more important, so we're going to get the construction done first. Okay, overview. Construction. Yeah, even you. Get, get all the construction done. And actually, I'm going to put in a cut here. Um, Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, it was rather amusing to see uh, some Outlanders taking out a group of pirates. It was very fortuitous because I wasn't really prepared for it. So thank you, whatever town did that. Until next time, take care. Feel free to uh, hit the like button if you're enjoying the series and would like to see more. Until next time.